think if you succeed, every mistake becomes a legendary. If you fail, that's just garbage. You know what I'm saying? I think everybody has great stories. Everybody has a lot of mistakes. Everybody has a lot of problems. But very few people listen to you. One day when you become successful, people listen to you and say, Wow, you are great. I'm not that great. I was born in a normal family. And I'm not good at schooling. Of course, I tried to study hard, but as a boy, you know, my school was not that good at that time. So I failed looking for jobs, looking for joining university, joining good schools. But I never give up. And I think there's one thing I learned is that um, why why you should have a chance to be successful. Everybody should get used to be get used to fail, but not get used to be accepted by other people. Why other people should help you? You should earn the right to be helped. So the thing I learned is that don't give up. My opportunity has not come yet. When everybody complains, that is the opportunity. I always thought when I was young, when I was graduate in, in the high school or university, I thought Bill Gates took off my job. You know, Bill Gates did all the successful things. Larry Ellison from Oracle, they they took all the wonderful opportunities. IBM benefit. We people have no opportunity. And I think I aim too high. I should aim to support and help the people around me. Do tiny things. I never thought I could be today. After 18 years, Alibaba become today's size. Not because I'm smart. I don't think I'm a smart person. But I have I work with a lot of smart people. And most of smart people they always want to do successful things, quick, easy things. And I think it's not easy to be successful quickly. Every time, everything we do, we prepare for 10 years. I know I'm not smart. If we want to be successful, we have to win 10 years later. If we want to be successful, we have to work with smart people. If we want to be successful, we should make a lot of mistakes and never give up. A lot of people, they make mistakes, they have problems, they give up. We never give up. We learn from mistakes. And I think when we fail, the message, the experience that I want to give you, the advice I want to give you, you will judge when this person will be successful or not by when he fail. He thinks it's his fault or the other fault. If he thinks my fail because of the others, this guy has no chance. Those people who fail always think, hmm, it is my fault. I did not do it properly. I should change here or change it there. These guys have opportunities. So I learn a lot from those people who fail. I learn a lot from those people who made mistakes. I learn a lot from my mistakes. So this is what I, when I, this is my life attitude. When I fail, I say, see, I will fail. When I succeed, I say, well, I never know, I could be successful. This make me very positive and optimistic. And because of so many mistakes, too much failure. That make me never complain. But I get used to that. We are making mistake every day, even to today. We make stupid decisions almost every day. Nobody knows. We thought it's smart, but finally proves stupid. But we learn, we do again. 
We learn, we do again. That's the way, that's the life attitude. Alibaba start from no money, no technology, no people. In my apartment, 18 people decide that we want to use internet technology to help small business. That was the idea. After 18 years, we grow from 18 people to today close to 60,000 people. It is really not easy, but we survived. Today, we are one of the biggest internet companies in the world. I think we are lucky. We made so many mistakes, but we still survive. How can you be continue to be lucky? That is the question keep on asking me. I think if you want to continue to be lucky, you have to give your luck to the others. You give luck to the others, you help others, the others in the future will help you. That was my our thinking in the past 10 years. Alibaba was born in China, but Alibaba should not be a Chinese company. The name, the day when I choose the name Alibaba, Alibaba is not a Chinese name. It's a Arabic name. And Iran said it's an Iranic name, Turkey says it's a Turkey name. I don't, I don't know where name, but it's the name from Alibaba 1001 Mistakes or Alibaba 1001 Nights, the story. We want to make this company a company that born in China, enable the world, helping the global young company, young people. As I said, that every century, there is a company for the century. Microsoft was the company of last century, of the great century. IBM was a company of the century. What is the company of this century, 21st century? And I think we should not think about uh, Alibaba. We should always, we make money, serve Chinese. We should make the money, serve the world, serve this century. This, only think in that way, we can do more. Our company today is big, but compared to yesterday, it was big. But compared to tomorrow, it is still a tiny company. The world changes so fast. So this is our thinking. We want to make Alibaba be the company of the century. We want to make Alibaba the company supporting global small medium sized companies. We want to make this company supporting global young people. And we want to make this company to making sure women can have more jobs online. Because people don't care you're women or men online. This is what we want to do. And we're doing a lot outside China, Southeast Asia. We are also doing a lot in Indian. We just started to do more in America and, the, and also Canada. In Russia, we have a small business that's called AliExpress. Maybe AliExpress here is very big, but in, Ch in our company, probably less than 1% of our business AliExpress. But AliExpress is not our main purpose of doing business in Russia. We do not want to be a Russian e-commerce company. We are not e-commerce company. We help other company become e-commerce. We hope what we want to do in Russia we want to help in Russia to build up the logistic system. Russia is so big, deliver things so difficult. Oh, I cannot imagine. I met some Russian girls two years ago. I say, do you use AliExpress? Yes. I say, how?